facts are very clear that very low dose of radiation is dangerous. The cancer is caused by many mutations, but it's the last mutation that you have that pushes you over the edge. And that last mutation doesn't take much radiation or insult to cause. My name is uh, Don Mosier. I'm a professor in the Department of Immunology and Microbial Sciences at the Scripps Research Institute in La Jolla, California. I'm also a council member from the city of Del Mar. Uh, I've been following the uh, issues at San Onofre closely for several years, and I, I, just one year ago, there was a meeting of the NRC in Laguna Beach um, at which I testified, and I was amazed to hear one of the Southern California Edison representatives state that radiation is good for you. <laughs> uh, I've worked as a consultant for the National Cancer Institute, and uh, I'm, okay, and uh, I follow the latest data on cancer research very closely. And I will tell you that uh, in my presentation, I'm gonna make two big points. One is that the current exposure guidelines for radiation are 20 years out of date and far too high. And secondly, in the last five years in the era of cancer genomics, we've learned how many mutations are associated with cancer how many mutations directly cause cancer, and that explains why the risk of very low dose radiation is so high. And we need to update our exposure guidelines dramatically. And I'll, in one uh, important illustration of this point, the National Institute of Medicine two years ago issued a report that said women under the age of 40 who do not have any family history of breast cancer should not undergo mammography because the risk of cancer associated with that radiation dose is higher than the environmental background risk. That dose is a fraction of a millisievert and yet the exposure a San Ovary worker is allowed to experience each year is 50 millisieverts. So when I say that the current guidelines for exposure are far too generous, we're talking about a log order 10 to 100 fold too generous. So I'm going to present some of the hard science for those of you who like hardcore science. Uh, in my talk, but the facts are very clear that very low dose of radiation is dangerous. The cancer is caused by many mutations, but it's the last mutation that you have that pushes you over the edge. And that last mutation doesn't take much radiation or insult to cause.